guys, we're here at the beach. They had uh, removed the bathrooms. I'm not sure where they're doing with them or if they're bringing something into Britain to put in permanently or not. Uh, still haven't fixed the, uh, the parking lot at all. It still looks the same. Still got the sand up on the top of the dunes to prevent water coming over. But as you look, this beach has been like this for probably, I'm guessing, 2015 right now. About 10 years now. Same old uh, lifeguard shack, same old uh, parking spots, and this kind of looks uh, really crappy for a beach that's uh, one of the best beaches in the world. So let's uh, show you what else they're doing over here at Bathtub Beach. It's a beautiful morning too. It's Bathtub Beach, north end to Bathtub Beach. The cabana, two houses on the corner right there. As you can see, the, the sand is still pretty much spread out, plenty of sand right now. Now what they do right here, they're just gonna start laying the pipes out. This pipe right here is permanent. The pipe goes over to where their um, main inlet is for their boats and, and uh, marina and stuff like that. And what they do is they pump the sand from there, they dredge it out, and then they lay these pipes, these long pipes. They'll extend all the way down to a clubhouse. So past this seawall, all the way down, they'll pump the sand from just their county part. As you can see where it says caution, this is where they stop pumping it. They take the bulldozers to pump the sand all the way out there. So my question is, they do this probably every year to two years. They pump the sand out, and they do it right before sea, well, a few months before uh, sea turtle nesting season. So it is November now. So we'll finish up around, should be around February, March, March at the latest. Um, what happens is at this time, the uh, north beach leaves come in. As you can see right now, if you've come to the bathtub lake, the pipe has already been shown. Well, weeks ago, about a month and a half ago, you couldn't even see that pipe. So what happens is the water, because we get north east leaves, we get, uh, tidal changes when the northeasters come we get a big rip current so all that sand goes right back out again so all this money that we spend on these beach nourishment projects are wasted all that money and all that sand comes in and goes out as you can see it's already starting to cut right into there just na that's what it does naturally so when it naturally comes over here it'll flow out take out the sand but what happens when it starts turning spring right around March April it'll start going the tidal change to go this way so what it'll do is it'll start bringing the sand back in again so naturally it just does you have a different time a season the sand comes out the sand comes back in so if you would leave it alone and not put sea walls up there because what happens when the water comes up as you see it naturally flows when it hits a sand wall there's too much energy it just takes more of the sand out because you're blocking the, the natural natural way of the water to flow over top of the sand so I wanted to see what you guys think but this is at bathtub beach the beach nourishment project north on the north Isle will last until at least uh, March or so as you can see it's already cutting in on our right side this happens every year naturally and now what happens the, the, the most the, the worst thing that happens though, the sand has to go somewhere. So the sand goes either south of here or it, as you can see right out there, it's a little bit, it's high tide right now so you can't see it as, as good. But right off the beach right here, there's that the reef right there. Well the sand goes over top of the reef. So what it does is over time, over time, it's going to prevent that reef being any, there anymore because the sand's covering it up. It's actually making it a more of a sandbar. So this is the Beach Walker reporting from the, the latest news at the Bathtub Beach. I'd like to have your comments, like, uh, like share, and subscribe. And uh, guys, take care of yourself. And hopefully, uh, Bathtub Beach looks beautiful right now, but you never know what it's going to look like day from day. So uh, please help out. You know what you can do, clean up after yourself, and tight lines guys, tight lines.